Hello everyone and welcome back to Battle Cats. Today guys, if I manage to achieve what I want to, is gonna be a very big day, all right? Cause I am gonna try and get my first crazed cat. I've, uh, I've tried these levels before and they are really, really, really hard. And I looked up a guide and um, I'm considered, I think, mid game right now. I'm not really like, you know, uh, I, whatever comes after mid game. Would that be considered end game? I don't really know, but um, I looked up a strategy and there's a mid game strategy for this that uses the cats that I have. And I'm really close to getting the uh, the extra good cats. Like, um, I think I think wall cat becomes a racer cat and macho cat becomes something else. Uh, let, let, me, let me just show you what I mean, guys. I am 1673 right now. If I can get another 27, user rank points or whatever, I will achieve level 1700 and I will unlock higher levels for normal cats. Upgrade to max 30. So if I can get that guys, all I gotta do is just hop in here. Nope. All I gotta do is hop in here and I can just go wham, 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 wham and my macho cat will evolve and then go wham, 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 wham and the wall cat will evolve, etc. Okay, so I got a lot that I can do. I got a lot that I can do if I can just get a little bit higher in rank. But I think I won't need to do that today in order to actually get past the stage I'm gonna try and get past. Okay, we're gonna go for the original crazed cat. Cause actually, um, there's three right now. The crazed fish, crazed gross, and crazed cat. I don't expect to get crazed gross or crazed fish. Cause I'm assuming they're gonna be a little bit harder. But I think I might stand a chance with the crazed cat. Now it's kind of weird, the strategy they recommend you use uh, involves this lineup right here. Boom. Look at that. It's six cats. They tell you not to bring any more than six cats because you're gonna be using the uh, you're gonna be using the cat CPU to help you get through it, and also the sniper. So I don't know. I might just go in and, and just take another look because I think I tried it once already. I'm gonna take a look and try the strategy without them just to see if I have the strategy down. Then I'll bring in the sniper and the CPU and give it a real shot. Okay? Wish me luck. Whew. Seriously guys, I'm starting to get in some really big stuff here now. Today I hit rank 1600, which allowed me to upgrade my special units past level 20. So you'll see that I actually have a bunch of really high level specials now. Well, a few, okay? The ones that I use the most are Valkyrie and Bahamut Cat. Bahamut is now at level 23, and Valkyrie's level 21. Obviously, I need to get these guys up. And then I can also use a Cat's Eye here to raise the level Cat above level 30, but they have to be at level 30 first. So if I can get one of them to level 30, I can then, I think, get them to level 40, which would make them even better. So I think the uh, I think the strategy consider um, considers you using Craze Bahama Cat at level 20, and I have him at level 23, which is going to make it a little bit better. And if I can't beat it, I'll probably just go back and try and rank up my units a bit more, or maybe get the 1700 rank and rank up my other cats, and then I should be able to beat it. It's kind of like a backup plan. My glasses are so dirty. Please be aware that this strategy most of the time does not work, so don't keep your hopes up. <laughs> that is really sad to hear, guys, but as I said, my Bahama Cat is a higher level than just 20, so I am sort of out of the mid-game area, but not quite. I'm almost out of the woods, okay? So the strategy is you stack your Bahama Cats, then when the Craze Cat comes out, Bahama Cats start going wham, 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 and hopefully that's gonna, that's gonna kill them, okay? <laughs> All right. Dark Souls insane, here we go. So what we need to do guys first is we need to let these guys get really close to the base, maybe even all the way to the base, all right? And then we need to send out five tanks. Five tanks are gonna go out, and when those five tanks come out, um, we're just gonna start stacking the Bahama Cats. But we wanna get them really close because Bahama Cat is gonna help them push back the other way again. You don't want any more than five because if you do, they'll be dealing too much damage, so go. Okay, you're hurting my base, but that's okay too. Three, four, and I'll also stick out Bahamut, and five. So now we just, we just watch and see what happens, okay? So I'm just gonna be watching now, guys, to make sure that no little souls pop up, because it might be hard to tell if one of my guys die, but that'll tell me that one of them died, and I'll replace it. See, because that took out a bunch of dudes, but it's gonna be really slow, so it's gonna be a really long, dragged out process here. And I'll level up as well, because I can't really do anything else right now until Bahama comes back. Which is gonna take a little while. This is a long, this is a long game right here. One of the guys just died, so here he is again. How many do I got? Oh shit. I'm already like super bored, guys, and I've only stacked one Bahamut so far. <laughs> well, I've got my level up to level eight, guys, so that's good. Not gonna use the cannon, not gonna do anything here. Uh, it kind of sucks that I'm only doing this as a trial run and I haven't brought in the other dudes, but maybe I'll get super lucky 
and uh, the other dudes, um, I won't need them. I don't know. Now, unfortunately, guys, this whole process is going to be a lot uh, faster now. We're going to move ahead a lot faster because there's two Bahama Cats, and I don't expect to get more than three, but we'll see. And here comes Bahamut number three. Okay, at this point, guys, we're getting really close to the base. We gotta send out, hold on, I'm gonna pause this, okay? Because this is very important stuff. We gotta send out a whole bunch of meat shields now, and then you turn on the CPU and you let Sniper help out. But I don't have CPU and Sniper, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hit some buttons myself and see what happens, okay? All right, guys, out comes the meat shield. We're about to hit the base. It's gonna happen. Oh, Jesus. I'm scared, I'm really scared. Okay, I'm gonna send out all the units now. I think that's the appropriate strategy here. Go, all the units! Meat shields! Go! Fire! I don't know what to do here! I'm scared! Help me! Okay, there goes the elephant, guys. That's good, because nobody wants elephants around. Come on, Bahamuts! You guys are moving back! You're supposed to move forward, you big idiots! Come on! There goes one. Boom! Got him! Now, I, I did this before, guys, and with my strategy, I got like, uh, I think I got him down to like 89%. Now, I can use, uh, I can use stuff here, right? I, I'm still, I'm still able to use my, um, my, like, restart or retry or whatever with the cat food. So I might give that a try as well. Ugh, this isn't looking good. Maybe I can get more meat shields? I mean, why isn't more meat shields recommended? Come on! Yes, we're doing it. We're hitting them a lot. Okay, now all the Bahamuts are dead, which kind of makes this a little bit, uh, a little bit harder. So I guess with Sniper, it might have been a little bit easier, guys. I might actually bring the speed up when I do this, because I don't want, really want to have to wait for all this stuff to happen. Okay, so I'll try a speed up as well. Um, and, you know, I'll have the Cat CPU and, um, and the Sniper. God, I don't know how this is going to go when I actually give this a real shot. Probably not much better. Well, the good news, guys, is Bahamut is pretty much back now, so we can at least give him another shot at it. Let's see, let's see what kind of, what kind of damage we did to this guy overall. Probably not nearly enough. Oh, we knocked him back. That is a good sign, but obviously knocking him back once is not going to be enough. I wouldn't be surprised if we had to do it a few times. We got one more shot left with Bahamut, guys. Come on, Bahamut. Do your worst. Or your, your, do your best. Probably, probably a better idea, you know? <laughs> and they're hitting the base. Stop that. Stop that. That's it. I told, I told you. I got, nope. Nope, nope, nope. How was it? How did we do? Not very good. Okay. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, guys. Okay, this is uh, this is my one of my strategies that I wanted to try. I am gonna go to the rare cat capsules because if I do a three capsule draw, I have a chance at these air busters. And then if I do another one, I'll get a seven capsule draw for like 600. Uh, okay, who the hell are you? Never seen you before. Jurassic Cat. Okie dokie. Give me that. Might perform critical attacks. Okay, fine. Next one. Oh, look at this one. I'm getting some new Ubers or, or some new rares I've never seen before. Welterweight Cat. Okay. Might knock back zombies. Okay. And a Salon Cat, which I've obviously seen lots of times. Hello, Salon Cat. Get in here. We're gonna, we're gonna, boom. Paris Cat's actually a really good cat. They recommend Paris Cat for a lot of different things. Step two, we get a million XP, which is one of the things I want because I want to level up the Bahamut and the Valkyrie. And we also get, uh, you know, five capsules. So let's give that a shot. Ooh, what is this thing right here? Oh, I got myself a new Uber, guys. I was thinking about uh, possibly doing a third capsule drop, but that one takes up like over a thousand, thousand and fifty or something, and I'll have like no cat food left, so I was hoping I could get an Uber or something. Because the third one has a million XP and a guaranteed Uber, so it's, oh, it's very tempting. Because I could get a second Uber, but it might end up being one of the ones I already have. This guy might knock back in slow floating enemies, so pretty good. I've already gotten this guy once today. I, I drew him with my like one gift. Uh, I got a gift ticket earlier for, for a rare draw. Okay, got myself another stilts cat. Not really that important, but okay. Got another one of these. All right, got myself a gunslinger. Okay, I mean, this is all helping me out a little bit, and I got a million XP. Yeah, okay, thanks. See, guys, oh, so tempting. I'll only have 44 cat food left if I do this, but I kind of want it. Can I come back? I have 28 minutes to decide, so... Let me see what I can do with this 1 million XP first. Well, I can upgrade Welterweight a couple of times, you know, because it's pretty cheap to do that. And I can also do the same thing with the, uh, the other cat I just unlocked. Where'd you go? Here we go, Jurassic Cat. I'll use that to get a few more rank ups, and I also got like four or five of them then. I'm only 13 away, guys, so I can definitely get the new, the new thing. Couple of levels up on that one, I suppose. Why not? Pretty cheap to do it. 
And now let's go to the special cats and put some real, real XP into Bahamut. Hey Bahamut, how you doing, bro? Here you go. Oh, you're expensive. You are an expensive guy. That's okay. That's okay. You can just be at level 26 for now. Here we are. Give uh, uh, Valkyrie a few more. I don't want to use it all up, guys. Let me see. How close am I now? Oh, three away. Okay, let me just upgrade a few cheaper ones. I really don't expect this to work, but why not give it a try? I have 36 cat CPUs. Like, holy crap. I got any speed up? I got 23 speed ups, and I have 11 snipers. So I have lots of stuff to do this with. So let's give it a shot. I could have I could have leveled up Bahamut one more time, but I decided not to. Oh shit, no, stop, stop, don't don't be here. The well, speed up is fine. I don't mind that. Now one thing you can do, guys, to make this last a bit longer is to make Bahamut Cat miss. I don't know if I'm gonna time this correctly, but I'm gonna give it a shot and go. You missed. Ha! Okay, good. So that's gonna I don't know, it didn't really do that much. I mean we still ended up moving, but okay. Okay, we're attacking the base now. And I'm just gonna put on as soon as he as soon as he comes out, we're gonna do sniper. Okay, sniper and cat CPU and go. So everything's gonna do on its own now. Uh, let's see what they can do. Okay, go. How much better are you guys? That is the question. I don't really know. I don't know if you guys got a lot better now with the whole you know Bahama cat at level 26 thing because you were only at level 20, so it's a big jump. They're doing a lot of damage and they're not dying, so that's good. You know, can you do it? I think they might do it, guys. I mean, they're doing good. There's a lot of good shit happening here. I think Sniper's helping a lot, and I think um, I think it's nice that I don't have to do anything. I think it's nice that there's a- oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. How much, uh, you know, I'm not even gonna- I'm not even gonna- just- just give it a shot. Just- just do- do your best. Oh. Oh. They're not moving ahead very much. Okay, I'll give them that. They're, they're not really doing a whole lot of that. They're, he pushed them back a little bit. All right, I'm saying he as if the CPU is a person, but it's not. We knocked, we knocked him back again. I think that's twice now he's been knocked back, guys. So we're probably getting pretty close, and the Bahamut is out. Come on, Bahamut, you can do it. Oh, this is, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy, guys. Bahamut's gonna get hit. He's not even gonna be able to. Yeah, that's what I thought. Do it. Come on, Bahamut. Yes. Come on, do it again. Do it again. I love you. I love you. Do it again. He's dead. He died, guys. He died, and I think it's all over. I mean, not, not really, because I'm gonna. I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the whole 30 cat food thing. How close are we? That's what I wanna know. I wanna know how close we came to actually doing this. Come on! <sighs> we moved them back, but the elef- the elephants, man. The elephants. How much we got? How much we got, bro? 53? That's not even good. Yeah, sure, continue. Let's give it a shot. Everything is still on, so do, do your, do your best. Bahamut can only get one shot before he gets knocked back, guys, and that really bothers me. Is he gonna- no, of course not. He's dead. You can't, can't get a second shot if you're dead, idiot. Let me see this. Okay, so Bahama Cat is not even close to coming back. This is bullshit, man! This is absolute bullshit! I hate you! I hate you so much! 42... No. No. No! No! Alright, here we go, guys. It's gonna be great. Okay, so now we can get our normal cats up. Energy's been refilled, thank you very much. And we are going to... What? Are you kidding me right now? You made it seem like I was gonna be able to upgrade them, but I can't? Is it, is it, I gotta upgrade, how can I, fuck! Guys, I thought if I got to that next level, they were gonna let me upgrade my cats, but it was all a ruse. What the hell, I read that wrong, I guess. It made it seem like I was gonna be able to do it. Well, we're doing the draw, guys, because fuck it, okay? Here we go. All right, we got a fortune teller, a shaman cat, a mer cat, another fortune teller, another stilts cat, another tin cat, and the last one has to be the uber rare that I've already gotten a bunch of times. And I know that people don't like it when I do this, but I'm changing it to XP because I could use the 1 million XP, okay? Now I have 2 million XP and 19 cat food, but I got some new cats so I can at least get a little bit more, so I have, you know, 30. I'm also gonna do something crazy here, guys, and I'm gonna go against what they recommend, and I'm gonna add in some new cats, okay? I'm gonna add in some more cats, because wouldn't it be nice if we had Aphrodite here? You know, just shooting from far away? I mean, she won't get a lot of shots in, but she'll get some in, and then once the CPU goes, it's only just gonna purchase her when it can, because you're not gonna run out of money either way, because there's just gonna be a lot of money, right? I think? Hmm. And obviously, guys, I'm gonna go to my special cats here. 
This has been such a ridiculous episode so far with all the things that I've done. But I'm gonna go to my special cats and I'm gonna bring Bahamut up as far as I can, okay? There you go. Now he's level 30. And watch this. Uh, cat's eye, how do I use it? Raise level cap. Usable on level 30 cat units. Well, let me use it. Oh, oh wow. Guys, I can bring the level cap up on the little macho cat, but I can't bring it up on my Bahamut or my Valkyrie cat. You can't, you can't promise me these things not give them to me. God, I'm so salty right now. I just wanted, I just wanted to do it. I got, well, I got them up anyway, okay? I, I use all my experience to get these guys up because I really want that cat. This, this has got to help, right? Here we go again. Trying it again. Fire. I did that on my own. Probably shouldn't have. Probably should just leave it to the professionals. Jesus, you guys are fucking shit right now. Okay, so they released some other dudes as well. I don't know if this was a good idea or not, but I mean, Unknown Cat can knock them back, which is cool. You know, maybe it'll help. Knock them back, Unknown Cat. Knock them back. I mean, how wouldn't it help, right? I mean, the dude, the dude knocks people back. It's always a good thing. And I think Aphrodite can take back, take, take on some of the people behind him, right? Okay, he's dead. He's dead. And the Bahama Cats are dead as well. Fuck. My. Life. I mean, this is actually not bad, guys. I think it's actually helping. Having Aphrodite there to take out the dudes before they start taking out the meat shields. I mean, the only person that can take out meat shields now is this little guy. And he's being pushed back. They're pushing him back. Where is, where is Bahama Cat when you need him? He must be coming up. There he is. Look at him. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. I think I might have done something good. Did I make a good decision for once in this game? No way. No way. Something bad's gonna happen yet. Something is gonna give. Look at this, everybody's dying, except the little guy who needs to die. Die, little guy! Here we go, slam him! Slammed him, okay, good. And you shoot the, shoot the thing, shoot the thing! Do the, do the, yes, okay! He moved him back again! He got my back again! He hitting, they're hitting him! There's no one, Aphrodite is doing it! Mega Aphrodite is actually doing it, guys! I'm so excited right now! We're gonna do it, oh! You know, as a YouTuber, you guys probably don't feel the pain of trying to do something in one session and not doing it. But it really sucks when you have a great idea for a video that you want people to see. Like, I want you guys to see me get this cat. And it's dead! <laughs> Eat my ass, you bitch! Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. I did it. I did it, guys. I was halfway through that match, halfway through that level or whatever. I was so depressed. And then my spirits picked back up again. <sighs> Unlocked a super rare cat. The craze cat. Get it at the upgrade menu. And I got my energy recovered. And I got a little bit of, um, I got 400,000 right here. So I'm actually going to use some of that on the dude. Okay. So here we go, dude. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Show me him. Oh, craze cat. The basic cat. Craze version obtains godspeed. But his legs are too short. This is gonna make a big difference, guys. I now have the Craze Cat Meat Shield. This is gonna be amazing. He's very expensive to upgrade. Oh, he's, he starts off expensive, but he doesn't ramp up very much, so that's nice. Okay, he's a level six. Let's just test him out, okay? Guys, I'm so excited right now. I'm so excited right now, holy crap. I know that I had to spend a lot of cat food and a lot of XP, and I know I traded in Kai, etc. But I made that decision to put Aphrodite and the other dude in, and Aphrodite actually helped us win. Guys, I love, I love her so much. She is my soulmate. Don't tell my wife. I'm just gonna go ahead and stick this guy in with the other cat. I guess he'll become Craze Macho eventually, and then Craze uh, Mohawk, I think, is the one after that. This is just a like a, a random unit, uh, a random loadout that I have. Um, well, it's not completely random. It has, you know, a little bit of red stopping power, a little bit of floating stopping, and it's been working pretty well, so I've just been using it to get through some of the, um, you know, some of the Stories of Legends stages. So let's go through one right now with our new cat, and it'll be amazing. What is this cat maniac? Oh, I gotta clear all nine crazed cat stages. Oh, well, Jesus. Not gonna happen anytime soon. All right, so right now, guys, I'm at Volcanoes Volcano. What a great name. And we're going to the Flame... Caldera or something. I don't know man. I'm just gonna send out my little craze cat and watch him go. Go craze cat go! Look at him, he's so fast. Look at the machos, like I'm gonna take my time. <laughs> Chew him, bro. Look at that. Mm. So I think the main thing that this guy has over over the normal uh, cat is the fact that he can um, he can just move faster. I'm pretty sure everything else is the same, right? I mean, Macho is doing more damage than, uh, than Crazed is because of course Macho is at level 20 something and Crazed is at level six. But yeah, look at that. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here, guys. I should probably, you know, do something else. Besides just have two cats here pushing forwards. Now, a boss is probably gonna come out. And when I find out what the boss is, 
I am going to send out the right units to take them on. Uh, most things have either been red or floating, and it's, you know, I've, I've got floating heads, and that big guy, well, the arms, he's, he's got two arms, but they're big. Why even bother, like, you know, putting out real units when you can just stick these guys out there and watch them go? Just saving up money, man. Something crazy is gonna come out of here, right? I mean, that would make sense to me. It's got a million health, and we're just knocking on the door, and it doesn't seem like anyone's home. Besides a couple little idiots, but they're not a threat. Something's gonna be a threat. Level 8, I got all my stuff, so if anything comes out, I'll just start spamming. At this point, I gotta start sending out my Ubers. I mean, I'm gonna max out. I can't I can't upgrade anymore, so here comes some Ubers. Halfway, I think that'd probably be a good point for something to come out and try and kick my ass. It won't, but it'll try. Oh, it's a koala! Oh no! Uh koala with an X. Okay. That's not very nice. You shouldn't you shouldn't have that Oh, he's one of those dudes, huh? Alright, well. Did I miss him then? Oh, okay. Do the floating guys get affected by this? Yeah, they do. Okay, it's gonna be all right, guys. Don't even worry about it. I got lots. I got lots going for me here. He's not that powerful. I mean, he has a pretty good attack, but you can push him back. He's got some pretty insane range, though, guys. He can actually hit Aphrodite while Aphrodite is targeting him. That's that is not good. Actually, I think he needs to move ahead just a little tiny bit to do it. But, but yeah. Go ahead. Send out some. Send out some meat shields, cause we're actually probably gonna die here. Oh my. Nah, it's all good. Just gonna start, you know, actually trying here. Oh, okay, he's dead. See, I told you it'd be fine. All right, so this is the first stage I have completed with my brand new crazed cat. I have to say, I'm very happy with him. I think he's gonna make himself right at home with us, okay? 121,000 XP for that. Oh, that's it, okay, so they changed it, so now it's six, there's six stages in, in, a, in, a, in a group now or something, cause there was eight before. Weird. Anyway, that is the episode of Battle Cats where I get the Craze Cat. I did it, and I'm really excited. And by the way, guys, um, the video where we're trying to hit 400K, there's only like 20K left, okay? So it's definitely gonna happen, but if you still wanna watch it and, and uh, help boost that up, you should do it. I'm excited. I don't know when the Mystery Cat is coming. It'll be after the campaign is over, but I will definitely show you guys when it comes out. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.